In this tutorial, we're going to have a look at how you can relink audio. And when would you want to do that? That you can do if you're in a situation where suddenly you have blank regions. Now, most of you might never have experienced blank regions, which is great, but some of you have. And now I'm going to run through what some of the reasons can be to getting blank regions. Usually when you open a Hindenburg session, what you have is a session file and the session folder. The session file is the file that explains where the audio should go in your session, how loud it should be played and so on. But it doesn't actually have any audio in it itself. The audio is in the file folder. So usually what happens is you open a session file and the session file itself says, well, this region here, it's placed so far into the session, the volume is so loud and so on. And it points back to the session folder asking for the audio and the audio we have right here. So this is what things usually look like. Now, what can happen is that for some reason, you only have the session file. You don't have the session folder. You might have moved some things around in your hard disk. We have heard about that before. But at the end of the day, this is what you end up with. You only have your session file. So what will happen now if you open this? It's going to say, I can't find any audio. Please locate it for me. And this we can do, we can say locate folder, find the right folder and say choose, and everything will be fine. What sometimes happens is we have the same situation. We have a session file, we open it, and we're now asked to locate the folder or files. What might happen is we just say cancel. And now we end up with a blank region. Oh, panic. What do we do now? Well, actually, what we can do is just close the session, open it up again and find the audio. But the new feature is that we can right click on this and say properties. Hindenburg is now going to tell you that this file is missing. If you didn't know this already. And here next to the file name, we have these three dots. It's a button and we can push it. And if we press this button, we are now allowed to search for our file. So this is the file that we're actually looking for. And you can see it's got the same name as what it says up here, relink interview.wave and interview.wave. That's the one we're looking for. I can just say open, say OK, and everything is fine again. So. If you ever are in the situation where you have a blank region, right click on the region, say properties and search for your file.